Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my page. My name is Ashley Morgan. Welcome. And today we are making shrimp and grits. I hope that you all enjoy this recipe. So the first thing we're going to do is start with our grits. I like to use whole milk because I love creamy grits. I mean, who doesn't love creamy grits? Once it's sticking to the way that we like it, we'll cover it with the lid, sit on the stove for another five minutes, and then start seasoning our shrimp with these seasonings that I've shown in the screen. I also use green seasoning, which is a Jamaican staple in our household. It's kind of like our version of sofrito. It is by far the best thing. If you want the recipe for my green seasoning, let me know and I will go ahead and share that recipe with you all. For my shrimp, I'm going to go ahead and add it to the skillet. I already placed some oil in here and we're just gonna cook it about 80% of the way. What I'm looking to do is build flavor as well as get some fawn on the bottom to help with my sauce. Once my shrimp is about 80% of the way cooked, I'm going to go ahead and remove it from the pan and then we're going to start our sauce. Add some butter to the pan, saute the rest of our ingredients. I will leave all the ingredients in the description bar below so that you can follow along once my ingredients are tender we're going to go ahead and add some chicken stock as well as a cornstarch slurry to thicken the sauce you could go ahead and make a roux from the beginning and add some flour and some butter in but i did not want to do that it is just so much easier to make a slurry a cornstarch slurry is just equal parts water and cornstarch and then we're just going to go ahead and cook our shrimp once my shrimp is fully cooked i'm going to go ahead and remove it from the stove and finish my grit add some butter salt black pepper to the grits as well as some milk because it was getting a little too thick <sighs> look how creamy these grits are. It was so good. I have a question. Are you a butter, cheese, or sugar person for your grits? Me in particular, I like all three. Don't shoot me. Don't come for me. But the mixture of all three together is just like, <sighs> I know it sounds weird, but you have to try it. Thank you all for watching. I really enjoy making these videos. If you have any ideas or recipes you would like for me to recreate for you, let me know down below. And be sure to follow me on Instagram at I am Ashley Morgan as well as subscribe to my channel. Bye.